hopefully uh you guys can hear that all right let's let's play right hear the crickets that's about it number one Some fools in the world hide how they truly feel. They think if they tell the truth, people would think they're guilt they're lame. Or maybe they think they're crazy. Okay, it's a little bit uh like delayed. I not like No, you guys want to do Hey. Okay. Uh, let's see. So still able to hear it. Cool. And they can't stand that, so they lie. So it feels delayed. I don't know. Is it delayed? I don't know. I feel like it is, but they let the truth slip. Places people would notice that to me is one of the lamest things anyone could do. We'll do wave out. I've always done wave out anyways. Game by Isolation Studios. Music by Old Duck. Old Duck. There you go. Support by Fly High Works. Alright, let's uh let's get into this. March 2017, four years ago, both me and Kani-chan were still studying in college. <laughs> That's awesome. Blocks. Move. Okay. Jump. Break block. Set block. Next. Close manual. Okay. Close manual. Move cursor. Move okay. Setting blocks. Uh set block is B. Move cursors. Uh, set block set a add setting mode. Try again. A B long press. Okay. Oh, close manual. Oh my god, I was like, what? Okay, cool. Let's do this. Go. The glowing blocks can be broken. Blocks you broke can be set anywhere. Enemy head, be careful. Wait, I can't. Be cool. Damn it. Yes, start, try starting over. No, I'm good. I'm pretty smart with this. There you go. Okay, cool. This part is easy as well.
Okay, cool. Unlock the door to clear the stage. Okay, cool. Alrighty. Hey, Connie. Can't you talk it out? Talk? I just... I just want to make a game I can be happy with. And I know I can't do it with her. So talking it out would be pointless. I'll have you know, the entire point of this assignment is to learn how to work as a team. We'll work towards the contest, but winning it isn't the objective, right? I know that. But still, I don't want to enter the contest with a mediocre product, but... Excuse me. I came to hand in my assignment. I'm a little busy now. Can you wait a moment? Oh, okay. Sorry. Anyway, there's bound to be a problem whenever, uh, whenever you work in a team. Can't you solve the issue with a discussion? Fine. These so-called pixel art graphics are just normal illustrations shrunk in size, right? I don't even see any effort made to clean the lines. So can you redo it and draw it in the style I requested? You're a programmer. What would you know about art? <laughs> see, it's impossible. Does it really have to be pixel art? Yes. Um, sorry, a minute. Mind if I interject? Hi, I'm Kumade. I'm in arts and design. I don't think we've talked before being in different courses. You're Kani-san, right? Programming and development? Well, yes. You're looking for someone that can create pixel art, right? So how about leaving that to me? Professor? Would it be alright if I switch places with the other artists for this assignment? If both parties are agreeable, I don't see why not. I'm in agreement. I can't stand working another second with a selfish trick like Connie. I actually wanted to try my hand in pixel art. But my team was against it because the style is too old. Connie, what do you think? Can you really do it? I'm pretty certain I can. Oh. This assignment I was about to hand in. Could I have a sample of my work in dot style? You can see and decide for yourself. But I have the skills you're looking for. And that's how we started making games together. Okay. Cool. Number two, April 2021. Wow. Five. After we graduated from school, we never got a full-time job. We decided we'd make a living by making games together. The reality was harsh. Instead of spending time making games, most of our time was spent working part-time jobs. Okay. She's going back to the Game Boy. <laughs> One, two. I love the sea. The salty air stings. Sand blocks can be set even if you break them. This will also fall, also fall without support. Ah, interesting. 
There you go. Kill the guy. There you go. Good, I got a block now. Um, let's see. Go up. Damn it. Damn it. I'm not, I have to do this anyways. Okay, cool. Uh, let's see. I need to build something right here. Get back up there. Get that. I'm gonna get my block again. I'm not gonna go back there again. Get that guy down. Damn it! <laughs> I fell again. Go up. Oh wait, did I place any doors? No. Okay, cool. Wait, I got it. There you go. Okay, cool. Awesome. Cool. Let's move on. She's done playing her Game Boy. I'm assuming she's at work. Hey. Oh, hi, boss. How's it going? What are you doing? What? I'm just playing a game. You idiots. Do your work. Uh, I thought something was off about you even during the interview, but I didn't think you'd be this useless. Damn. Sorry. What is the matter with you? Well, uh, you said I could take it easy when there are no customers around. So I thought maybe I could game just a little. Stop making excuses. <laughs> He's so mad. Jeez. I don't care if you're a game creator or whatever. Get some can common sense, won't you? Do you know what people like you are called in this world? A social misfit. That's what. Damn. I feel sick. Oh, hey, Lucky. How you doing? Welcome back. Yes. This is the last game I'll be streaming today. I feel sick. What am I supposed to do in this situation? Oh, that's right. Think of the cat. The cat. The cat, no. Views of Mysteria. Oh, nice. There, much better. How is it? Okay, I have to calm down. Are you free today, Debbie? Hey. Your games aren't selling, and you're short on cash. That's why you're working here, right? Did you ever consider your games don't sell because they're made by a loser like you? Oh god, this is stabbing in the heart. This is... Are you listening? I've had enough. That's my line. Just fire me and stop shouting. Kami-chan not being able to stick to one job was one of the reasons why I was... It was a struggle to make a living. Number three. Later that day. Every time we made a game, Kami-chan lost more confidence. The reason was simple. Our games wouldn't sell. Of course it hurts. I like the crack on the screen. It's like... Three. Damn, you take so long to... Oh god, no. Games are dark. No shit.
<laughs> no, fuck me, bro. I'm dead. Fuck me. Why do I feel like it's gradually getting worse? Yeah, this story is pretty dark. I want to say dark, but it's like really realistic. In a sense that... You've got a character that wants to make a game. But it's not selling. Look carefully before you make a move. Grab that. Okay, cool. It definitely requires a lot of uh, thinking for sure. There's so many of those fucking things there. Yeah, let's go. Gotta be I gotta be really smart with it. Oh my god, bro. Okay, I need to like. I need to. Let's put one here then. There you go. Okay, I completed the level. Okay. There we go. Level has been complete. Oh, hey, Kami chan. Why are you here? Welcome home. I thought you had work today. Well, I quit. It wasn't for me. Again? Like I told you, it's not for me. A 9 to 5 job. Socializing. Uh. You do realize we're in a tight situation, right? This is like hitting home so much. Like when you want to work on like what you want in your career, but like you have all these things you have to do that are like in your way. I'll find another job soon. Anyway, I read your script. How was it? Story about saving a princess from a demon lord. Right? A classic storyline. Nowadays. Who wants to save a princess from a demon? Then, what do you suggest? Hmm. For example, having the protagonist die halfway unexpectedly, or having a plot twist somewhere, or using a me met meta fictional ideas. We need something like that to get people talking about it. Get people talking, huh? Also, I need to discuss the fact that the gameplay is second to the plot. Honey chan but that was your idea. You said you wanted to make a game centered around the storyline. Yeah, I did. But what is the meaning of continuing this way? Making an old school game with a predictable ending. When are we be creating a game that is worth making? I guess. It's suggested we start over again. Drawing attention, having meaning, whether it's worth it or not. I don't think any of that 
matters to you when you created games in the past. But of course. Now it's work. It's a difference. Damn, that is so crazy when you think about it. <laughs> it's crazy when you think about it. He said, but it's work now. That. Move my pink to the left again. Gotta move it, you know? Now that we are not playing. Myself badly bigger. Make sure I'm in the corner right there. There we go. Perfect. All right, we're good now. Now we can continue. After we started making games professionally, how much time began to change? She, she, did she lose her passion? Number four. April 2017. About a month after we met, I remember asking Kami-chan, Kani-chan, a question. It was also the same time I started, call, started calling Kani, Kani-chan. Blocks. She plays this game all the time. Careful of the lava. Watch your step. Okay, so I gotta be patient here. Okay, cool. Have to kill this dude. Oh my, it's one of those. Damn, I'm dead. Yep. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. So I have to be careful with the lava as well now. Uh, I need to kill this thing. Sorry, so let me kill it real quick with this. And I'm going to go down here. Get this. Can I jump up here? I can. Maybe I should get my other thing again. I'm going to get my other block again. Just in case there's a very specific area that requires me to have all of the blocks. Woo! Woo! Whoa! That was way too close of a call. Oh boy. Come on. This lava thing is annoying though. Oh, oh man. Oh my god, that was close. Yo, what? I'm playing a game within the game. That's crazy though. No shot. I missed. Oh my god, no! I wonder if it ends the game if I like. If I like die and then she just. And we still continue the story regardless. Kill this thing. Woo! I sped through that one. Woo! Whoa! Woo! God! I was so impatient there. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god, that was a close call. Oh man. Okay, so those are clearly spikes.
wonder if this is their game. That they're playing right now. Or that she's playing right now. I wonder if that's the game that she's Oh, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh boy. That. No shot. I did not jump there. Anishan, can I ask why you make games? Okay, yeah. It continues on. Anishan? Having a nickname would bring us closer, don't you think? Call me Kumi-chan, too. No thanks. Man, she has no, like, familiar familiarity. Like, she has no interest in becoming friends. Okay. Here's your order. Coffee? That's me. And a Wiener Melange. Is that you? Oh, yes. Please enjoy. So, why do you make games? Why? Well, so I could get a job in the industry, I guess. That's why you want to do well in the contest? That's right. Okay. <laughs> she's, she's happy. What's that face? Nothing. You have something to say. <laughs> I just thought, if you're really doing it for a job, wouldn't you make a game more suited to the current trends? That's valid, actually. Then let me ask, what do you draw? I draw because whenever I can create a, a feeling in someone, maybe surprise or excitement, even when I see that shift in the motion, that's when I feel truly alive. And that is what you call passion, guys. Never lose passion. And it just happens the way I can do that. Is by drawing. Your copy is going to get cold. I prefer it that way. We became closer as time went by. Okay. The more we got to know each other, the better our game got. Everything was so fun at this time. But what? <laughs> what happened? Number five. I guess I was being optimistic. I thought overcoming these tough times would add to our personal growth. So I thought it'd continue to support Connie Chan on this endeavor. But I was wrong. I, for a year, a very long time, hadn't seen. Connie Chan enjoy making games from the bottom of her heart. That's why I. Oh, what's gonna happen? Oh man. Lock. All right, let's do this again. Two one. Starting me with some. Uh... Quick levels, I see. Damn, bro. Oh, fuck me, bro. Did I fuck up already? <laughs> yeah, I fucking... Oh, man. I fucked up right there. Get this right here.
Ja. That guy out of the way. No, what? What? How the fuck? <laughs> How the fuck? Am I supposed to beat this game? If I can't fucking, uh... What? What if I... This? That might be it. But, but then, but then I wouldn't be able, I can't do anything! What? I can't place any blocks here because, you know, right here, you know? I can place blocks, oh, right here. Alright, I'm gonna get my blocks again because, uh, you know, I'm gonna need every single block I can get. Where do I get up there? Aha! There we go. Okay, so I need to get up there, so let me... How the frick do I get up there? <laughs> how the... how? How? Oh no, I see what I have to do. I've... Wait a minute. I can still do it. I can still do it. That's right. Yeah, let's go. That's what I'm talking about. I can jump in place at the same time. I don't know if that's intentional, but it is for me. No! I fucking died. That thing. Okay, well, we continue the story, so. Is it fun? I mean, this game? Oh, here we go. We're gonna get serious. It's just. eh. But you play it all the time. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. But it's just. meh. Oh. You seem so sad. I used to think it was fun. But from a game creator's perspective, it's just meh. I see. The interface isn't well done. It's hard to understand. Even the level designs are whack. Well, you know all about that. Oh god. I wanted to tell you I've decided. Decides what? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. What's gonna happen? I'm getting a full time job. What? Why so suddenly? It wasn't sudden. I got an offer from my boss a long time back. He's wanted to hire me full time for a while. So now I've been turning him down. Oh. 
Are you okay with the fact that you won't be able to make games anymore? Oh shit. Do you remember the promise we made? What promise? Oh! Damn! <laughs> I guess you don't. You know, in my job at the cafe, they let me illustrate the menu and create boards for special deals. And the customers that come by tell me my designs are cool or my pictures are pretty. They just look generally pleased with my work. And that's enough for me. That's all I've got to say. Damn. This got real, real quick. I'll go now. Hey, Connie Chan. Can I ask you why you make games now? She doesn't have an answer, does she? Thanks for everything. It was fun. Damn. She, she said nothing. And she's gonna go play her game again. Damn. The cat? The cat is back? I hear a cat. She lost her passion. That's what happened. Number six. What is this about? I wonder when it was that I started to believe in myself too much. Let me lower, let me make my a little bit smaller so you guys can see the entire thing. Little me fever. There we go. A little me version of me. A mini version. All right. I never fit in anymore anywhere. Can't even hold a proper conversation. When did it happen that someone like me started to believe I could make something that would bring praise? When did I start dreaming? Creating these conceited delusions. The real me is someone that can't even deal with how ma my best friend feels. I'm so selfish. Oh, you know what would have been a cool touch if the screen cracked more after that? To show that, you know, she really did, like, hit it hard. Back with the fan. Let's go, baby. Damn it. Uh, let's see. What do I need to do here? No. No. I need more. Do I need more, though? Put that here. Oh, wait. I remember I can just, like, do the... This right here. Oh, wait. <laughs> I just... I could just go down here. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, cool. Get that. That there. There we go. Go up there. 
I can go up here, get that. I fucked up a little bit. No, no, I think I'm good. Never mind. No, yep, I fucked up. <laughs> I fucked up. Damn it, bro. Fucking fucked up, bro. Damn it, man. I was just so good, too. I was like... Damn it. <laughs> So I'm assuming she lost interest in the game or like into gaming or something. That's why she lost her will to or like her her passion, I guess you could say. Lost her passion. Yeah, I'm gonna get all the pieces I can. Let's put it right here, right there. That one. That one there. And jump up. Go there, get that. And do it right over here. Then I can do the thing here. Uh, I think I fucking made myself stuck again. Oh no, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. I think I'm good, I'm good. Yep. Oh my... Fucking... This fucking game, bro. This fucking game, bro. You're drawing nice. Okay, what's happening? September 2017. Are you alright? Yeah. It happens sometimes. Okay. Hey, Kanachan, what makes you feel safe and happy? Do I have to answer that question now? Just tell me. It can be anything. Something that makes me feel happy. I guess, uh... Cats, maybe? That's so unexpected. I imagine you dislike animals. <laughs> Got a problem? Did you ask just to make fun of me? Oh no, I didn't mean to. I just wanted to share something I do all the time. Whenever I'm nervous or under stress, I think about things I like. <laughs> what makes me happy is Alicia. <laughs> Give it a try, Kani-chan. It might make you feel better. Maybe I will. Will the resp will the representative please step on stage? That's you. I know. Cats. Think about cats. All right. Hey. What? Thanks. Oh, this is back when. We at the intercollect. Uh, that is a that's a big word for me. At the intercollegiate game contest held nationwide for students, we won first place. It was completely unexpected because I was simply making something I wanted to make. What am I doing now?
December 7th. July 2021. Wow, it's been so long. After that, I continue making games alone. Something designed for hype. Having reason behind creation. I tried not to think about any of that. And then, I finally went, made one game. Okay, here we go with blocks again. She's been playing this for so long. Alright, I haven't beaten like any levels in like two times. Let me go to this side. No? Okay. Fine. I'll go to this side then. What the? <laughs> There's nothing to do here. What? Literally, I, I can't do anything actually. What the heck? Whoa! Wait, do I have to fail the level on purpose? Yo, that's. Wait a minute. Do I have to fail the game on purpose? There's literally- oh wait, no, they, I, there is something I can do. Wait, what am I doing? There you go. Yeah, let me go this way. I was about to say, I was like, man, they got that dark, you gotta fail the game on purpose. <laughs> got that serious, man. Uh, I'm sorry, what the frick do I have to do here? There's no way I can run up that, right? There has to be a way I can win the game, right? There has to be a way. Can't just be all... That's crazy! There's no way I have to fail the game on... Okay, I'm just gonna fail the game on purpose then. <laughs> Let's see, I'll, I, let me let me fail the game on, on purpose then. Hmm. Well, it's certainly playable. Thank you. She made it! So, what do you think? You're asking me if we publish this, right? Well, the answer is no. Um, why? You brought in their really old console. You know we don't publish for this, right? I don't mean for it to be published specifically for that console. Really? What's the sales pitch? Oh, she's nervous. She keeps moving side to side. It's made to run on retro consoles. That's pretty unique. That doesn't add much to the actual gameplay, does it? This is the harsh reality of the world, though. In fact, that would limit distribution. That's a negative to me. Besides, if the customer were to choose... Wouldn't they prefer to play one of the old masterpieces? Yo, that's true. Why would they choose to play a fake retro game made by an unknown... Cr oh, that is... A fake retro game. That is crazy. He's not entirely wrong, though. That's... Retro technically means... From the past. One of, the, like, the classic games. It happens surprisingly often. That in pursuit of originality... Creators lose perspective. Wow. I just... Just what? I just wanted to make something I truly wanted to create. That would be totally fine if you were doing it as a hobby. Take a good look around you. 
This is an office. We're a company doing business. If you could make money by simply doing what you want, life would be so easy. To be honest, what caught my eye in your games wasn't the game itself. It was the pixel art Miss Kumade created. Now that that's gone, who plays console? Go put it in PC. They love old style games. <laughs> I don't see any bad in games you bring me. Hey, um. I mean, there are literally people out there that just play for the visuals than the gameplay or the story. You know? But people like what they like. <laughs> you mentioned you two, you two separated because of artist differences. What are you, an indie band? Are you sure Miss Kumade didn't leave because she started making games that won't sell? Kumada didn't. Kumada didn't what? I thought you came here to talk. Kumade. Only Kumade saw value in the games I made. I know why Kumade left. The real reason why. Number 8. September 2017. Damn, I kind of want to know what happens. <laughs> I'm not going to lie, I'm very invested in the story right now. <laughs> Bro, what? Oh, oh. Oh, yeah, okay, see. I, I thought it was like a another one of those death games. Fuck me, I didn't jump. I I could have made it. I I could have made it. I know I could have. Jump, please. Thank you. <laughs> no, 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 no. Burrito. You want burritos? You craving for burritos? Mother you know what? It's okay. I'm just interested in the story right now. The story is actually really interesting me. We got the prize bef because of you, Kumare. All the judges praised the visuals. They didn't really talk about the game itself. Are you being humble? You know I'm not the sort. Yeah, I do. Hey, do you know why I asked you to do I asked to do the art for your game? Why? Because I was looking for someone that could draw pixel art. And you wanted to try your hand in it. Right? I wouldn't have offers for that reason alone. I hadn't even talked to you before after all. Then why? In my freshman year. I went to the exhibition held by students in programming. You know, the one for end of the year projects? Must have been boring. All the games displayed were poor copies of hit games. And I was a bit disappointed. I bet. But then, there was this desk with a single console placed on it. Everybody was doing their best to promote what they made. Calling out to people to come play. 
But nobody was at the desk. And it was apparently nobody was going to come. Nobody took notice of that game. So I decided to give it a go. Really? The game felt so nostalgic. It brought back memories of games I used to play as a kid. And that's what you call retro, baby. Like Pokemon Ruby's retro for me. Knowing there was someone in school that could make something like that made me really happy. Can you tell who I'm talking about? Honey chan your game really touched me. It was a coincidence we met at the teacher's room that day. But I've been waiting for a chance to talk to you forever. I was going to say, let's make a game together. That's why. I don't want you to think you did nothing to deserve the prize. Thanks. Well, to be fair. I also thought it would be better if I did the graphic instead. <laughs> huh. Granny chan you know? You can afford to be more confident. What a good friend. I like how this has like a, a memory filter over it. Oh, it's a memory. I think I won't get a full-time job after I graduate. I thought you said you were making games to get a proper job in the industry. Do you seriously think I can work in a corporate environment? Lately, I hear there are a lot of people that make games independently. Yeah, indie gamers. I thought maybe I could give that a try. I was thinking... It was fun working with you. So. If you were up for it. Would you like to join me? I think I can make good games if it's with you. Sure. Let's do it. Really? It sounds ambitious, but I love a challenge. Besides, making a game with you was fun for me too. Can you promise me one thing? Oh, here's the promise she forgot. It's all fun and games while we're students, but I bet, I bet things will be different once this becomes our job. After we turn professional, we might start feeling different about creating games. It might become stressful or even overwhelming. So, if we can't make games with the passion we feel now, let's not push it and quit. Promise? That's the promise? Wow, that's a tough promise, I'm not gonna lie. I never forgot. It's just that if I said I remember the promise, I felt like I'd have to face the truth. The truth that now, making games had become suffocating. And I was scared to admit it. That's why I pretended to forget. If I didn't lie to hide how I feel, maybe things would have been different now. Umani might have never left. And maybe we would still be making games together. If I'd just been honest. I know it's so sad. Foster passion. 
number nine. Ninth of July, twenty twenty one. Oh, here we go. Damn, she's ignoring the call too. You play the game. Damn it, bro. I didn't get a jump start. Bro, pick up the phone, bro. I think I can make that jump over here. Fuck me, bro. Fuck these damn bats. This is going to be such a hard thing to do. Oh, shit, shit, shit. There we go. Well, now I can place... One right there. Jump here. This one there. But first, I gotta wait for these damn bats to. Damn, there's so many. What the hell? I got nervous. Damn it. All right, we're fucking game over. Someone trying to text her, or is she like, not? Is like like a an alarm? Hello, Kani Chan. Hi, Kumari. Been a while. Up. Oh. Well, uh, I was wondering how you're doing. Oh, so you do care about me. My training period ends this month. After that, I work full-time with benefits. Don't I sound all grown up? Yeah. Cool. So, what are you up to, Kani-chan? Still making games? Yeah. Right. So, how is it going? Well... I, I did it. I made a game. What? I took it to a publisher. That's great! Not really. It wasn't received well. Oh. Got told it isn't good enough. So, if you have the time, if you don't mind, can you come to where I play the game I made? I'd appreciate some advice. Hmm. Well, um, sorry. I guess you're busy. Oh, uh, that's not it. I was just wondering if I can give you any helpful advice to you at all. You can. Because... You've always been the only one to take my game seriously. Okay. Oh god. So, what's the plan? What do you mean? When do we meet? This is kind of sound like a, <laughs> a love story. And it seems fine for me. Come at your convenience. Then, how about next Tuesday? Tuesday. 12th of July, right? Yep. Okay. Let's do this. What time? Anytime. <laughs> I'm always home. 
An afternoon? Sure. Oh! Wanna grab lunch together? If you want. Damn, <laughs> she's so like... Aloof. Okay, great. Like, she's... It's me Tuesday afternoon. Get lunch together. And after that, I'll play your game. Does that sound good? Yeah. Anything else? No. Oh <laughs> god. You're so depressed. Okay. We'll see you then. Yeah. Later. Later. You can tell like from the little pictures who's talking as well. I wonder what Kamada will think of this game. Would she find it nostalgic again? Would it move her? I couldn't tell her over the phone. But I'm going to say it when she comes to do it. Okay. Maybe it's, maybe it's lame. But I'm going to ask if she'll make a game with me again. Ooh. Number 10. April 2019. Okay. Back with the game here. <laughs> I haven't been able to beat this damn thing. Damn, bro, I can't even get that. Go up here. Ah, yeah, motherfucker! <laughs> I got fucking nervous as hell. <laughs> I got nervous. All right, come on. I gotta jump over you. There we go. Need to get these rocks right here. Jump here. There we go. I think I can do this and then go have there you go. Oh jeez. Uh, there you go. A game with a game. Yep. <laughs> a game within a game. How are you doing, Dim Silver? <laughs> Get that. Let's see. What's next? I can jump over this easily. Okay. Kill this damn thing. Well, I can't kill it because it's being protected by this. Oh well. I I can go over it, so it's all good. I'm gonna. Oh no! I'm gonna have to do a freaking. Long jump right here. Oh, okay. Oh, that was a close one. Will I be able to beat a game for once? Oh, yo, oh, my God. Oh, fuck. <laughs> fuck me, bro. I got so far, damn it. I got to do everything all over again. Damn it, bro. I remember the games used to be like this. You know, they would be like, just constant playing again and again. Up over there, jump, 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 get that, get that. I got it pretty much down. It's just those few times that I actually like get nervous, you know? Oh, no, like that. See, that, that was pretty bad. <laughs> There we go. There we go. Jump. Jump. Fuck me. Alright. Game over. Okay, let's see what the story has to say. Are they moving out? Right. Let's start.
Okay. Um. Sorry. Mind if I interject? A memory within the memory. Hi, I'm Kamari. I'm in art and design. You're looking for someone that can create pixel art, right? So, how about leaving that to me? What's gonna happen, bro? I'm so nervous. You can see and decide for yourself. If I have the skills you're looking for, he's remembering all the memories they had together. Having a nickname would bring us closer, don't you think? You can call me Kumi Kumachan too. So, why don't you make? Why do you make games? Whenever I'm nervous or under stress, I think about things I like. Sure, let's do it. This is such a bittersweet. Is this the ending? I swear to God, bro. Making a game with you was fun for me, too. How oh, bittersweet is this is the ending, man. Oh, it's, oh, that's actually really sad. So this is from today onward. This room. This room is what? From this room is going to be our place. This is back when they started making games together. Yeah, we're in this together. Kuma. Oh, she calls her Kuma. This is the present day when she's all alone. Oh my god, here we go. Twelfth of Ju oh, this is the day. This is the day. Twelfth of July. This is the day they get to meet again. Fuck, bro, are you freaking. <laughs> yeah, it's a it's a dark level, and. Fuck. Uh, what am I? Oh, this is such a hard level. What the heck? I have one life left. Let me not screw it up. <laughs> God damn it. God damn it. All right. All right. Story time. When the day came, Umane didn't come. Sorry, Connie chan. One of the part timers got sick today, and I've got to fill in the spot. Umane had already found a new place to be. And I realized the day we've spent together had already became the past. So, um, 
Can I take your rain check? What I thought was the place I belonged to didn't exist anymore. Oh man. Oh, she's trying to think of the cat because that's what she likes. Did you ever consider your games didn't sell because they're made by a loser like you? Wow. All oh, right, her boss told her that. I'm in agreement. I can't stand working another second with a selfish jerk like Connie. Oh, she's having a mental breakdown. What caught my eye in your games wasn't the game itself. It was the pixel art Miss Kumade created. A loser like you. Selfish jerk. I don't see any value. He's having a mental breakdown. You know, in my job at the cafe, they let me illustrate the menu and create boards for special deals. And that's enough for me. That's all I've got to say. There's no one in her life now. No, oh God, it got dark. Don't tell me, bro. Oh God, did it? Did oh oh God, it got dark as fuck all real fucking quick. Hopefully I'm wrong. Oh God, I hope I'm wrong, bro. Kana, Kani Chan, are you there? I'm coming in, okay? Hello? Hey, I got worried because she wouldn't pick up the phone. Hey, where are you? No! I get to fucking move around finally? What the fuck? Oh no. Please don't tell me she did what I think she did. It's Connie Chan's desk. There's a game console on it. The screen's cracked. The window's open. That's a balcony, my dude. Oh no. Anisha? Oh fuck, she did! Oh my god, bro, what the fuck? I'm gonna play the game too. Oh, <laughs> she got dark as fuck. Hi, Kumare. Oh! <laughs> fuck. This is so fucking dark. It's gonna be a message to her, isn't it? Yeah. Firstly, you've reached the last stage. Thanks for playing till the end. It means it when I said you're the only one who takes my game seriously. I thought hard and long about what you said. You were right. Oh, she took the quit part literal. I I'd lost myself. 
I was concentrating on what would sell. It wasn't for the money. It was more about pride. I wanted to prove I could make a hit. And create something people would praise. I wanted to prove I'm capable. In the past, I was a lot more self-centered. I never thought of the player. I didn't care what they thought of my games. It was their fault if they didn't get it. I really believe that. I know I'm egotistical. But I felt so free then. I'd forgotten how I used to feel. But after you left, it all came back. So I made things I made this game. This is just something I truly wanted to make. Publisher hated it, but I don't care about that anymore. It was fun to make. You're always asked why I make games. Oh, we're about to get the answer fucked. And I never gave you your proper answer. The truth is, I didn't know myself. That's why I couldn't answer you. But now I can tell you why. It, I make games. Because it's fun. That's all. I want to tell you something. And that might cause you more trouble than good. <laughs> oh shit, here we go. I'm not ready for this shit. But... When I was making games with you... It was even more fun. So... I wanted to ask you... Oh no! You, you'd finish making this game with me. I don't care if it becomes the last game we make. Can we? Oh man. Try again? Oh man. Oh god! Some fools in the world hide how they truly feel. They think if they tell the truth, people will think they're lame. Or maybe think they're crazy. And they can't stand that, so they lie. But because they're not very smart, they let the truth slip in places people would notice. That, to me, is one of the lamest things anyone could do. That's how the goodbye world. God, that was a dark fucking story. The clock is ticking, marking the soon. Oh, wow. That that was um That was something else. <laughs> That was definitely something. I mean, I definitely enjoyed the story. It was, at the end of the day, it was a story about a struggling indie developer that her stress kept getting, how do you say? It just kept piling up. 
Special thanks, Anne Ferrero, Uma, Gaito, Ito, Games, Sochi. Wow, there's a lot of people that worked on this, actually. It is sad. Wow, it got dark real quick at the end, though. <laughs> I saw the open window, and I immediately knew what happened. And then the fact that she went outside, and she looked down, and she's like... She called out her name. It was... Wow. Yeah, I, I I wonder if there's like something more after this. I mean, obviously there there isn't gonna be much. I wonder if like the gameplay affects the ending. If there is an ending or like a different ending or not. Bro, by the way, this game is E for everybody. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna lie. This is, on the box of the Switch game, it says E for everybody. Um, so, I'm gonna just let that sink in. Uh, considering ending theme, Walking in My Sleep, Artist, Noah Mall, Able Galaxy Train, Game Development, Isolation Studio, Programming, Fuji, Fujika Kanji, and Graphics, Yoko Kumade. Oh, don't tell me it's based off of a real story. I would all oh, that is if it is, that'd be so crazy. Are you sure the game's all right like this? Of course. What now? Just why is it made like I died and then? Bro, I swear to fucking god, you asked for it. Oh my. Something with a plot twist. Has men metafictional ideas, and the protagonist dies unexpectedly. Oh, I'm fucking dead. A story like this would get people talking, right? What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I think. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? They just juked me and everybody watching. <laughs> what the fuck? Bonus unlocked. What the fuck is the bonus, huh? Okay, wow. That was definitely a twist I did not expect. <laughs> what the fuck, bro? Okay. Well, that's the main story. Wow. <laughs> This is, uh, it's been great. Honestly, this was a great story. I uh, enjoyed it. The ending definitely fucking got me. I honestly thought that, you know, she, um, died. So, yeah. That was a, that was a dark ending if it was going to be like that. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> if it was going to be like that, it was going to be hell dark. But, uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching again. I do appreciate it. For anybody that was here. Lucky, Debbie107, Asu Del Mar. Silver, thank you guys for being here. I do appreciate it. everything uh, for your time right there. Thank you very much. Thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate it. You guys have a fantastic day. I'm going to go eat and then I'm going to go edit some videos and see if I can get these videos out on YouTube today. So thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys later. Ciao.